Femi Wajabi Amila, Speaker of the Ninth Assembly, officially hands over the leadership of COSAP, Legislative Mentorship Initiative, as he gets set to quit as Speaker of the Ninth House of Assembly. In his handover speech in Abuja, the Speaker Femi Wajabi Amila says Africa can survive only by its own ingenuity through the efforts of their own hands, through sustained cooperation with one another in the spirit of brotherhood. Bajabi Amela said this during his official handing over of the Conference of Speaker and Heads of African Parliament, as well as the official handover of Legislative Mentorship Initiative to the Institute of Legislative and Democratic Studies. On his path, the Speaker of Ghana Parliament, who is taking over from his Nigerian counterpart, extolled the exemplary qualities of the outgoing Speaker of COSAP. Institute of Legislative and Democratic Studies has played a valuable and foremost role in developing the governing capacity of politicians and policymakers in Nigeria since the return to democracy in 1999. Through degree programs and short courses, capacity building events, research and publications, the Institute has advanced our democratic practice and proved a valuable partner to all who desire a more effective government working for the benefit of the Nigerian people. Under the leadership of the Director General, Professor Abubakar Suleiman, the National Institute of Legislative and Democratic Studies has been a valuable partner from the beginning in planning and executing the vision of the Legislative Mentorship Initiative. I am therefore confident that the initiative will be safe in his hands with the support of the capable men and women of the Institute. In every way I can, I will remain available to support the mandate of LMI ensure its continuing success, and guarantee that the vision of this initiative is sustained through inevitable trials and challenges. The mentorship initiative, which you just handed over to the National Institute of Legislative and Democratic Studies a short while ago, is yet another testimony of your foresight, innovativeness, and commitment to ensure that parliaments play a pivotal role in national life that gives full meaning to their function as a legislative arm of government. Nigeria and COSAP will indeed remain indebted to you. Your Excellency, I have accepted with all humility the honor bestowed on me as Speaker of COSAP in the firm belief of your continued support and commitment to our collective objectives and agenda. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.